What's up, Philly 20 fam? It's your girl, Nettie Nettie, and I'm back. I'm about to try and get Dean with a prank video about my ex. But I gotta see if I can hide the camera in the car. We're in the middle of moving, so it's a lot of stuff in here. As you guys can see, he has a lot of bags in here that he's taking to storage. So... I'm gonna put more stuff in the car. Crazy. I will never be able to How long he's gonna take of the store. But I'm gonna have the camera back here, okay? So I'm gonna go see him. Hello, the way I have to go. My bag. I'm not gonna cut it. I'm gonna keep doing, but I'll just get it all this extra out so you don't have to sit here and wait. But um, trying to think, cause he knows that me and my ex are friends, so I might say something like, you know, he asked to take. Oh. Hmm. Well, I was gonna say he wanted to take me out to lunch or something crazy. And I could, because then he's gonna trip either way, whatever I say about him. So we'll see. Alright, alright, fam. I'll get with you guys in a bit. I'm waiting for him to come on. <sighs> My batteries are running down by the time Dean comes. So Anyway, while I'm waiting, I did. I watched the Neek at Night video where she was talking to Tasha K. If y'all haven't watched Tasha K's interview, and I'm telling y'all this is for the real women, watch her interview, her receipt interview. Not the interview actually with Star, but the receipt interview. You'll understand everything a lot better. You'll understand <coughs> why Star Marie came out. She came out mainly because. Right. I can't be talking to y'all for the week. 
So it's taking long. So I might have to do this prank later. But anyway, I need to talk to y'all. So anyway, my thing is. We can't say we believe everything that this lady is saying. But I believe what she's saying. There's no way to hide anything like that. I think he's coming because I see the door shut. So let me see. I'm good. I'm good. Oh. Thanks. I'm good. Oh, I forgot you had to get the. I gotta out. go back inside the house. Why would you forget? To I leave? gotta go back inside the house. I'll be right back out. It's fine. Rainy days. Yep. I'm gonna have to edit, guys. Cause this is a uh, major. All right, so it's this box that's covering them. And I wonder if you can see I can't like swing this here because then you'll see it. And we ain't got no big pranks popping here, okay? So I'm just going to have to lead the family here for now, okay? So the words are just as good, babies. All right, so. Mm. I'll, I'll get them. I'm, I'm going to just come up with some crazy conversations. We'll see. Watch. I don't know what happened between Nick and Neek. Um, I mean, Neek and Tasha. Um, I don't think there was any arguments or anything, but there was a little bit of disagreements in the stories. And um, like I said, that's why a lot of us bloggers just uh, do our opinions on what we think because a lot of us are adults. I'm sorry, what? No, I said I was trying to think if I should get this in breakfast or just wait. Sorry, wait. Yeah. Baby had to think about it. They redid this yesterday, but look how flooded it is. That's not my problem. Well, I don't know. I don't care about what these people do when they worry about the streets. This bitch right here is real funny. Like, oh, my boss is. My boss is worried about the lights, man. I bet she was looking to see That's what else. she said? Yeah, like you worried about so much what your boss is doing. Thing. What lights? You know, listen, what you worried about everything that your boss is fucking saying to you, but he's not giving you more money you wanted. But you telling me about the lights you worried about. I don't believe you. She actually went and looked in the back of our car. Because so when she seen us today, I guarantee she going to say that well, shit to the though, office. They never called but us in three months. Come it on does, now. It doesn't matter. My thing is, I don't trust these maintenance men here. Well, they can't do anything. You don't understand. I don't trust you them. Come in there taking you, shit. That's what I'm worried about. No. Because they say that the, the maintenance men here are very sneaky. Well, okay. And Jose stopped speak, speaking. He but all our shit, just Jose stopped speaking. Stopped speaking. Jose stopped speaking. Well, I guess. It's not weird. It's that he's doing his job, so whoever he's coming with, they probably were talking shit at the office. He probably was over there, he was with somebody else, so they was probably talking shit at the office, so he couldn't be like, oh, you know what I'm saying? Wait a minute. What? No, everything's okay. I just want to make sure I ain't drop my keys. But, um, yeah. So there was one other person that said that he could lend us money if you want, and I don't know if you will. Who? Never mind. I don't even want to know because if you were talking to somebody I don't like, then that means that they was in our business. So I don't even want to know about it then. Larry. What Larry? I don't want to know. I don't want nothing from Larry. My ex. I definitely don't want nothing from him. He still owes you money, so he can give you the money he owes you. I just don't want nobody. No, I was telling Zach. That's why I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't want to. Um, I don't want no help from nobody. And he understands what I'm saying. Yeah. Because when people, they obligate, they feel like their kids can come <coughs> to your house. They can come over there. Like they have reasons to get involved in the middle of our relationship. We've been doing this thing moving. I moved th about three times since I've been here. And nobody was running. You understand what I'm saying? But I can't do it because I'm 47 years old. And I got to be alive for my son. I can't do that shit no more for everybody else. 
is the reason why me and my mom is arguing right now. Because she told me some shit like this was gonna happen, but she did the same thing too. So what am I supposed to say? My mom told me this was gonna happen. She said, you gonna put all your heart into raising these kids and they gonna not be able what to do nothing for you when get over. And it's not so much the kids. She was wrong about the kids part. But it's more so the parents like you're the savior for people and I ain't come back to be the savior because we hurt and if we you had as, oh, if we had as much love if we had as much love as we was given to those kids I guarantee you Dean wouldn't be the way he is that van is flying in a school room So I don't know how you want to do this. Do you want to um do it by the back staircase instead of me walking all the way around? Yeah, that, that's up to you because that is a lot closer. Yeah, and open up the side. Then all right. you gotta do, all you gotta do, is just stand out there, maybe. Yeah. If we can get that spot where it's lining up directly right, with the right, you know, right. it's that's better smart. than going yeah. all the way around. You know what I'm saying? Then at least I'll feel safer that nobody ain't gonna come snatch a bag out the storage. I ain't trying to be funny, but niggas in New York do that. Like y'all don't understand, you'll be moving and somebody will walk right in there and take something out. Oh, I would just sit in the car if you want me to. Get that one. That's, I, to you. that's all you gotta do. I'm gonna be going to the storage right. Is right there. You know what I'm saying? We know who's upstairs basically. I'd just be worried about, you know what I'm saying? Because in New York, they'll take your shit. So right. would you like let Larry take me out to lunch if you wanted to? Nah, I wouldn't do that. I mean, cool like that. I wouldn't do that. Because I was, I, I, I can't do that. I can't do that. I wouldn't do that either. No, I can't I do that. You. The fact that you're asking, that's what worries me. <laughs> it's a prank. In a rush, you in a rush to roll back to Amber. Now you're it's a prank. I'm really, I, listen, I'm burning up. I'm burning up. <laughs> I'll turn the heat off. Yo, but I'm burning up. Guys, I got him for the first time. Whatever. I got him. Yes, y'all. Successfully got the Mr. Martin. But I'm going to have to edit, edit, edit. And because he said a lot, he said a lot, so we'll get back, we'll get back, guys. Yeah, we'll nice. get back more later. <laughs> Love you, lots more to come. New apartment tour coming soon. Holla back, guys. Always keep God first. Love yourselves as well as loving others. And yes, I've had a year to breathe I still miss my mommy but I'm on a better better path being blessed that's what you call it so love you all and I'll be getting back with y'all later on that woman gossip that we need to talk about too so I'll be back with that too